Uh, my dad actually found this gym for me. He was just doing his research about Fort Knox and he seen a boxing gym right outside. He called the coach up, spoke to the coach, so the coach knew about me before I actually got here. I'm going to do a couple of tournaments around here before I go off to California to fight for uh, the National Power to join the WCAP team. You know, they want a soldier to represent the United States across seas and stuff for the Olympics, so it was the best, best option for me. I've been working with private homes um, close to a year now. He, uh, he's a very talented guy. Uh, he has, you know, everything it takes to be an aspiring professional boxer. I think he's brought a, a certain, a, a great deal of respect and discipline um, um, from having a military background because for one, um, as him coming in here being a, a, a bigger guy and a lot of youth is in the gym, you know, that's something aspiring to these young kids to see a soldier that's coming in here putting in some serious work. I just want to be a good example for them. Cause you know, they may want to join the Army, go to the Army team and go to the Olympics. So I want to show them it's possible and be a positive person they, in their life, you know, as much as I can be when I see them here. So. Yeah, he bring a lot. The Army done definitely, you know, got a certain type of discipline that they create great young men and women. But Holmes definitely has it, you know what I mean? If he has the time, time, time to put into it, the Army got something on their hands that that guy get into the U.S. Boxing Academy with them, that's for sure. I just want to go win the gold and bring it back. <laughs>